Hello, welcome to Musher's Tales. Remember that culvert trap? Connected on a rat. Uh. Not much filming today. We're setting and setting and setting uh, the last line and uh, don't have time. You know, and there's the same old stuff to film over again. Just to show you moose hunting pressure, there's a moose hunt line there. I see one over there. We passed two on the way here. Buddy's gone to get the bike right now because we walked here and we realized that we can drive right to this spot and there's some beaver. So, of course, people leave their crap everywhere. And this is, this is middle of nowhere there. I guess that's a new feeling, I don't know. We passed two salt blocks about a kilometer apart. This is the edge of our territory. I mean, then if you see the moose blind way down there, that's still our place, but a little bit further it's not, it's an outfitter. Gray Jay's picking at the uh, steel and beta of the bait bucket. If you can see him. He's about four feet away from the camera. Maybe I'll leave my sandwich alone. Different spot, different Jay, obviously. You know, we're uh, very far away from the other spot where I had the gray Jay eat my sandwich. Lunch time view. Still by the lake, but we're sitting down, so. Double G's. Ham. What? I got meatloaf. And I hear the gray jay, oh, the gray jay's right above his head. <laughs> he says you don't change a winning recipe. So this is, look how wide this trail is. So I'm gonna snare this trail. C'est facile à accorter pour qu'il reste en place. Hein? Anything. See the wire 
So back at the house getting things ready for tomorrow. Uh, ended up putting in uh, about 18 Martin boxes, uh, four beaver traps and uh, half a dozen snares. And uh, that's it for this video. Maybe see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.